What is up? Welcome to the channel, Ape and Hodel. Here we go, we're talking about a new project. It is an NFT marketplace type MMORPG and something they're calling GameFi. It's built on Kadena. It seems pretty, pretty, pretty cool. Pretty cool. This is not financial advice. Do not take any of this advice as a financial advisor because I'm not a financial advisor. Do your own research, do all that stuff. Uh, we're gonna talk about what I like about this, why it looks pretty awesome and I'm excited, and also what concerns me a little bit and what to be careful of, what I'm weary of, and what I'm kind of looking at with a very serious eye. Anyways, so this project is called the Miners of Cadania. So it is an MMORPG game. It is also featuring has NFTs. I found it through Marmalade, the marketplace for NFTs for Cadena. What I'm the most interested in is playing the game. I would like to play the game, but unfortunately it is not out yet. So currently the mock topic, the uh, uh, currently, so currently the mock token, which is the miners of Cadania token, it is the token that's gonna be the type of currency inside of the game is at 17 cents. They finished their uh, initial distribution offering of 50 million mock tokens, and that has already been completed. So basically the idea of this game is to create a massive multiplayer online role-playing game where there's also a type of DeFi, marketplace, NFT trading, all of these things. And one thing that they're doing that seems pretty awesome is that other developers and other builders are going to be able to add to this world. They're going to be able to bring their ecosystem into this world. It's going to be this massive, basically metaverse type uh, NFT game, play to earn game. But there's also going to be DeFi aspects. There's going to be staking. Uh, there's going to be a DAO. So that's something that's pretty unique and pretty cool. If they can pull it off, that's a big if, and that's kind of the most important part. So basically one of their missions was to make DeFi simpler for people that certain that the general public does not know how to do yield farming or staking or lending. So they wanted to put all of that into a game. So you're going to be able to play this game. You're going to be able to earn mock tokens and trade NFTs, maybe earn NFTs. There's going to be a ecosystem, a currency ecosystem within this, but it's supposed to make it more user-friendly for the general cryptocurrency investor, buyer, fanatic, Gen, whatever. So it says that it acts as an expanding metaverse in which projects across Cadena can build and integrate with that metaverse of the miners of Cadania or the world of Cadania, I guess, per se. So basically right now, it seems like they have this image of the marketplace and the tavern and the town hall, which is going to act as the DAO, uh, kind of uh, art basically to show you what this world could look like. Now... I want to see what it actually looks like eventually. This is just kind of a, just an image at this point. I think they have a good idea for all the other stuff, but the most important part to me is that the game is awesome. It's addicting. People want to play it. People want to come back and play it. Uh, now, Cadena is not a huge ecosystem at this point. If you, you probably already know this, so I think there is risk in that Cadena itself needs to continue to grow, continue to expand, and then this game needs to build traction. So before you go out and just ape into mock tokens, think about that. Think about the risk you're taking on. Uh, this is uh, not fleshed out yet. This has not even been released. Uh, still very, 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 very early. So here we have the token distribution. Uh, it looks like about half of the tokens are going for either staking or rewards in-game play. We have another 10% of the tokens that went to the initial distribution offering, which was 50 million mock tokens. And then the rest of those tokens are basically going to either investors, the team, it says marketing. So a large percentage of the total supply of the mock token does seem to still be held by either investors or the team of the miners of Cadania. So I would be definitely weary going into this. I would love to get a chance to talk to one of these guys from the team. If you guys somehow see this, I'm doing an interview series. I'd love to have you on. I'd love to talk to you about this, learn more about what you guys are doing and just uh, get in front of you for a second. Uh, if you like this, please smash up that like button. Hit the subscribe button. Help me out. Doesn't cost you anything. Helps me a bunch. And I recently made this cool swag here. This is uh, this is the very first, basically, of the op. This is 
basically the first of the Ape and Hodel merch line. There's going to be a couple different versions of this, t-shirts, sweatshirts. If you want to check them out, they're in the description there. Awesome. So I want to do a little research on who's behind this project. If you look at Dor, Dor Tavdishvili, sorry, I probably butchered it. I'm sorry. If you look at uh, the founders uh, LinkedIn, unfortunately, there isn't a lot uh, going on here in his past work, which uh, kind of could be a red flag. I don't know. I don't know. It says uh, fintech sales, fintech sales. It doesn't give a company. Uh, it doesn't say where he worked, but you know, I don't want to necessarily throw anybody under the bus. I'm just saying that if you've been in D5, you've been in the space, if you've been in crypto, there have been a lot of rug pulls, there have been a lot of scammy stuff going on. You got to be really careful. So, um, yeah, it's also, I'd like to uh, be able to talk to this guy and see what's going on and see what they're doing. I'm, I'm, I'd be excited to check out this game when it comes out. I hope it comes out sooner than later because it seems like it's kind of been a while. If you check out their YouTube channel, they have these little funny videos um, that are kind of uh, goofy and some of them are songs, but they were posted about a year ago and not much else has come out. Now, if you look at their Twitter, about 11,000 subscribers, not bad, or 11,000 followers, not bad, uh, but, uh, and they are posting to their Twitter. They are active, you know, I think, what we'd all like to see is when is the game coming out? When can we play it? I think that's that's what it's all about. Because for me, I wouldn't really get and invest and get deep into this until I've played the game and I just know what it's like and I know how fun it is. Uh, but I found this project, so I thought I'd bring it to you guys, see what you think, because a bunch of uh, my Cadena videos just do the best. You know, I love a bunch of other projects, but no one watches my other projects. They just watch my Cadena videos. So I guess I'm going to just keep making videos on Cadena. I am not affiliated with this game or the people behind this game at all. Uh, this is, I am just making this video for educational entertainment purposes only. So I don't have any skin in the game with these guys. Uh, I am holding KDA though. So full disclosure. Now, if you come onto their website, I want to see is the game out? Can I play it? Uh, they have this cool animated moving text image of exploding rocks and crystals coming at your face. Uh, which is cool, you know, and everything, but basically everything's just coming soon. Everything's coming soon. Nothing's arrived yet. Nothing's finished. Nothing's really been rolled out. So we're just going to have to wait and see.